Hello everyone and welcome back to Hunting Simulator 2. So there's now a new DLC pack out for seven new Beretta shotguns and they are the 686 Silver Pigeon, the 695, the A400 Upland, the A400 Extreme Plus Mo Mossy Oak Bottomland, the A400 Extreme Plus Max 5, the A400 Extreme Plus Synthetic, and the A400 True Timber. So, I mean, paying $5 for seven new guns is kind of a stretch for some people, and I'm just going to kind of take a quick review of the guns and tell you if they're worth it or not. So, the guns themselves are actually pretty unique. I was not expecting them to be this good. So, what the new Beretta shotguns have to offer is a more lightweight feeling compared to the other shotguns in the game currently. When you're kind of tracking and trying to hit a moving target, they do much, much better. They don't feel as heavy. You have an easier time staying with the target. And surprisingly, they seem to feel like they have a lot more range to them than a lot of the other shotguns. They are just super super good so for the price of five dollars you are actually getting seven very very good guns if you do pay the money i can say that you will definitely get your money's worth and it's going to be hard to ever really switch off of these for um, waterfowl hunting i mean they absolutely do amazing so the other advantage that these guns give you is I mean, the increased range we've already talked about, but with that increased range against rabbits, these things are so much better than the other shotguns. They make the job so much easier. And I have found that you don't have to get as close to rabbits to kill them. With these things, they do so much better. And you, I mean, you don't have to get within 50 yards or anything. You can take them out from a greater distance. And it's just, it's, it makes it a lot easier to kind of fill out your lodge. So, in that sense, I mean, obviously other shotguns work for rabbits, but if you're looking for the easiest way to get rabbits, these things really do the job quite well. And another advantage they have for waterfowl hunting is you're going to get two with one shot pretty frequently. I was amazed at how the spread of these things can, can, I mean, you can, I got three with one shot at one point. I almost had four, but just, it's so good against waterfowl. You will not be disappointed with them. And I mean, they are great looking. They did a great job with the graphics on these. The reload animations are real smooth. All of the guns look real shiny and brand new, and they're just an absolute pleasure to use. So... I mean, it would have been better if the developers kind of put in maybe an in-game event to earn these, just to give kind of people something, something else to do in the game. But I guess $5 is not the end of the world, but honestly, the game could use a little more of a different activity for players to do to kind of earn something work work towards. But if you do pay the $5 for these, you can certainly have a lot of fun with them. Um, the best spots to use them, I would say, are in the marshlands and the ponds around the cabin. You can find tons of ducks out there, and these things will complete a duck license in under five minutes, I'd say. And just make sure you bring a pretty high-level dog with you, as you, you're going to be having a lot of ducks retrieved. The longest part of your hunting session will be waiting for your dog to bring the ducks back because you will be downing ducks so quickly you won't be able to count how many you're getting so anyway final verdict on these are that they are super lightweight and fun and i would say worth the money so if you enjoyed the video don't forget to like and subscribe it really helps out the channel and if you feel like it leave a comment down below and just kind of ask me any questions or suggest any content and i'll see you in the